Satya Nadella of Microsoft, Sundar Pichai of Alphabet, Parag Agarwal of Twitter and now Lakshman Narsimhan, the new CEO of Starbucks, becomes the latest to join the rank of Indian descent CEOs who are leading US corporate giants. Narsimhan joined Starbucks in October and will relocate to Seattle from London. He'll work closely with the iconic Harvard Schultz until he takes over in April 2023. A Pune-educated executive, Narsimhan has a Master's in Business Administration degree from the University of Pennsylvania's Wharton School. Narsimhan was the Chief Executive of Anglo-Dutch Multinational Reckitt, which also makes Durex condoms and Entermeal baby formula. He had joined Reckitt in September 2019 and was the first external candidate to take the helm since it was formed in 1999. He led the company through the pandemic which boosted sales of its health and hygiene products. More recently, he navigated a baby formula crisis in the US culminating in a raise in its annual forecast earlier this year. The 55-year-old has also held several leadership roles at PepsiCo, including as its global chief commercial officer. Nasiman has also served as a senior partner at McKinsey & Company. He focused on its consumer retail and technology practices in the US, Asia and India. As the CEO of the world's largest coffee chain, Nasiman will be paid $1.3 million in annual base salary and will also receive a $1.6 million cash signing bonus. As per Bloomberg reports, he will also be getting a replacement equity grant with a target value of $9.2 million to make up for the incentive that he is forfeiting by leaving Reckitt. Lakshman's appointment comes at a time when Starbucks is facing a turbulent period and is reworking its business model. Over 200 of its US stores have unionized in the past year with workers pushing for better benefits and wages, and that too at a time when inflation is surging. Also, COVID restrictions in China have slowed the US coffee chain's business in one of its biggest overseas markets. The road ahead will not be without its fair share of challenges for Narsimhan. Present CEO Howard Schultz believes that Lakshman is the right leader to take Starbucks into its next chapter. Independent Starbucks Board of Directors Chair Melody Hobson in a statement has called Lakshman Narsimhan an inspiring leader. Meanwhile, Twitter has gone into an overdrive after the news broke as the Indian community abroad is ready with its list of requests. Many have requested the coffee giant to include the beloved South Indian filter coffee in its global menu. So thanks a lot for watching. For more such updates, stay tuned to Money Control. It's rare to find news and insights tailor-made for you. For clutter-free content and value-added insights, India's number one financial news destination, Money Control brings you Money Control Pro, an ad-free premium service that offers its subscribers curated market data, feasible investment solutions, exclusive noise-free information, independent equity analysis, and sharp opinion. Money Control Pro, India's fastest growing subscription service, has offered valuable content to subscribers in sync with their interests and demands. We are now a family of over half a million active subscribers, consistently helping our users on their wealth creation journey and enriching their awareness around business and finance. We are grateful for the continued support of our loyal readers and subscribers for making Money Control Pro an undisputed leader in its category. And if you are yet to experience the rich offering, subscribe today for a seamless, uninterrupted access to a gamut of business and financial information. Be a pro with Money Control Pro.